right guys and welcome to Project Productions today. We're going to be having a look at apparently some leaked information about uh, Black Ops 3. Um, this has been posted on Reddit. We're just going to read this out and um, see how legit this is. The ranking system will now be a thousand ranks with a system similar to prestige mode every hundred ranks. So it said they've had a system similar to prestige mode. What this is going to be I don't know. Um, don't know where they're getting this information from. Um, and every hundred ranks, and apparently it could be a thousand ranks in total, which may sound like loads, but to be honest, if you put it in perspective, um, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare has over 1,600 um, ranks at the moment. With they've got 30 prestiges and 55 ranks um, per one, and um, 100 ranks per prestige. I think that's quite a lot. But um, Modern Warfare 3 actually had 80 on it, and you could actually go through that quite quickly, and that actually worked quite well. Um, the AK-47, AK-74U, and Intervention were returning. Um, if this is going to be linked with um, the first one about um, modern time and Middle East affairs, then this this is actually quite likely because the AK-47, AK-74U um, are quite uh, commonly used weapons by. Um, people in the Middle East because um, they're quite cheap and the intervention obviously that being like um, US Army so you know that that actually could happen to be honest so this is um, so far sounded like maybe legit I don't know or not um, but this one this one may may, may be um, pushing a little bit small terrain vehicles snowmobiles and four-wheelers will be featured only in the few large maps in multiplayer these vehicles will also have a limited supply of weapon ammo that anyone can refill with. These vehicles can respawn and also be blown up in many ways. Right. So they think they're going to add vehicles to Call of Duty. This this absolutely makes no sense whatsoever. As there's been no really um, ideas to um, add vehicles into Call of Duty, and there's no reason. To add them into Call of Duty because at the moment, you know, the game functions fine without them, and there's no need for it in the game. And with, with the size of the maps, even if it says the larger maps, I don't think, I don't think it would work at all. Um, your online rank is now optional to be universal across multiplayer, zombies, and even the campaign, which means you can rank up in all these modes if you choose to. It's saying that you can rank up in the campaign, right? So, you can get to 15th prestige by playing beginner AI that is just stupidly easy and you can get to 15th prestige. That makes no sense, okay? That makes no sense whatsoever. Um, right, the next one. Uh, we've got fuel grenades will be a new grenade. These grenades are filled with liquid gas and explode on contact, like a Molotov. But... With a twist. They can detonate like C4. So you can just throw them out and detonate them in there and they create a barrel of fire when the liquid lands. So basically they're saying that we're getting a Molotov C4. Um, I, this sounds so genuine that I think it's going to happen. Um, the RC car bomb is returning, you know. It's been in the last two tryout games with an option to take off and fly in the air and crash into the ground or manually detonate it. And enemy players will now be highlighted as triangles. Right. Um just just a few things about this point. An RC car that can fly. So we're now having flying explosive cars that can kamikaze. Um so we basically, what the person who wrote is done, take an R6D, um, a, like a load star, um, and, um, what, freaking dragonfly, and mix them all together, and then we've just got this, and obviously this is going to happen. But now the last one, which is, a, this is a very, very good point, which, you know, this feature is definitely, definitely going to be added into Call of Duty, without a doubt. I don't know how they haven't done it already. There'll be a new 25 kill streak called Psycho. You will have unlimited health, 
unlimited ammo, unlimited equipment, and unlimited UAV, and every perk for a full minute once activated. So we're saying that if somebody gets 25 kills in the game, they are invincible, they never run out of ammo, they never run out of C4s, and they can see everybody everywhere. So, you know, this is very likely to happen because, you know, um, Call of Duty likes to make their games fair, and, you know, this is definitely the road they would take to um, make the game fair and make sure everybody's having a fun experience on the game. So yeah, um, I'll leave a link to this um, article down in, in the description, and you can ha uh, thank the person who wrote it, Mr. Big Body Presence, for putting these absolutely genuine facts down here. And yeah, I'll catch you guys later. Bye, Directions, out.